Hi, I'm Darren. I'm Shelley. We've chosen early retirement and a life of freedom, adventure and the unknown. So for the next few years, we're going to be travelling around our beautiful country of New Zealand in our caravan and then at a later stage, some more overseas travel. So subscribe and come along with us as we embark on our next adventure. Good morning. So we're finally morning. able to travel again. <laughs> so we um, we came through from Timaru to Omaru yesterday and um, stopped in Waimati for a look around there. And um, yeah, so we're staying out at the, the showgrounds here in um, Omaru. And so we just come out this morning for a bit of a look around um, the shops and things. Um, it's going to get really windy this afternoon. And then it's, I think it's rain again tomorrow. Um, so we need to make the most of it today before the wind gets up. <laughs> but you can see some of the beautiful old um, buildings here. It's really quite a stunning place. So we just come down here to the um, Victorian precinct. Um, it started to blow a gale out on the, the main street there, so we can't do any filming out there, unfortunately. But hopefully we can do a little bit in here. It seems a little bit um, more sheltered. But yeah, certainly some stunning old buildings. There's the old um, steampunk museum in there. So we'll definitely go in there for a look over the next few days while we're here. Criterion Hotel, established 1877. Wow. Wow, now that is a cool street. What a cool old street this is. Wow. And 
unfortunately a lot of the um, the, the little shops and things we wanted to go into to have a look um, aren't open until level one so there's a sign in the window over here just saying exactly that too so there's a few um, cafes open but um, all the other shops and galleries and bits and pieces that we wanted to look at unfortunately aren't open so never mind still a pretty cool looking street <laughs> Certainly is some very cool buildings. Good morning. We're um, still here in Omaru at the moment, um, and it's a beautiful looking day out there today. So we're going to head to the um, Steampunk Museum this morning. Um, and then I think we'll make the most of the lack of wind and head off this afternoon and head th back up north towards or, yeah we'll probably go to Geraldine I think um, this afternoon and spend a day or so there um, we had a a really wild bunch of weather that came through here um, two days ago and um, it was really strong norwest winds that were blowing straight across the showgrounds here and um, and I was hitting at it was sitting right on the side of the caravan that night and uh, it was like we had a rugby team outside shaking us from side to side so um, it wasn't a very pleasant <laughs> pleasant night's sleep um, so we probably aren't that keen to do that again so um, we've actually moved the caravan around so it's pointing into the wind again um, now but um, yeah, I think we'll make the most of the um, nice day today and make a move. Tomorrow is supposed to be really windy, and then Monday is rain. So if we're going to move, today is the day. Otherwise, we've got to um, stick it out and, and wait. So, um, yeah, so we'll take you along to the Steampunk Museum this morning, and then um, we'll come back and hook up and um, head to Geraldine. That's certainly an interesting looking train, isn't it? <laughs> Bomb come through the side of it. <laughs> People have got some great imagination, that's for real. Oh, I wonder if I got a two dollar coin on me. <laughs> what a cool place this is. Pretty dark in here, so I'm not sure that this uh, camera will show up too much, but there's some pretty quirky sort of stuff going on in here. <laughs> Oh, 
Oh god, the old dentist chair. Yeah. Look at that. Oh my god, that's a, I was going to say, the, uh, this real Mad Max sort of stuff, that I used to actually operate one of these planers. <laughs> How bizarre is that? Back when I was a timber machinist, I used to operate one of these. Exactly that machine, 1952 Robinson, 52 or 54. Identical. Wow. <laughs> Some people have just got some amazing imagination. You don't want to buy a new dress or something? <laughs> Is that the portal? Wait till light is green, open door, push red button. It's nice to actually finally be able to um, film outside because it's just been so windy. Here's Darren on his new motorbike. Yeah. Just call him Mac. Cannon, Omaru Cannon. <laughs> 
This is our new house bus, is it? <laughs> yeah, it needs a bit of rust repair. <laughs> nice and roomy though. Truck, yeah. Oh, well, that was pretty cool. I'm glad we um, were able to see that before we left. So we'll go back now and pick up the um, caravan and and, uh, and head off, I think, and then we can just sort of take our time and pop in and see a few places on the way. for a, um, a drive down through the Victorian precinct again because I think it's just so cool So, so good that they've um, preserved it all and little businesses have set up here and unfortunately a lot of it's not open at the moment because of this stupid bloody virus we've got but yeah <laughs> Good morning Good morning well, good morning from Geraldine. We arrived here yesterday um, and we wanted to come out this morning um, and show you a little bit of the what the shopping centre and that's like because this afternoon we've got our second wave of bad weather coming through. <laughs> so it's, go, it's supposed to get really windy again this afternoon and all of tonight it's going to be blowing again as well, a northwest wind. Um, so yeah, we'll um, have a bit of a look around this morning and then hunker down for um, <laughs> the rest of the day and this evening. But uh, yeah, in the meantime we'll show you what Geraldine looks like. So at the moment we're staying on the northern side of Geraldine um, at a place called um, Grumpy's. <laughs> it's a, a Kiwi holiday park. Um, it's on a camp saver, so $22 a night. Um, but yeah, and, and it's only about 
probably five or six kilometers um, north of Geraldine itself um, but yeah I mean it's obviously it's just a little little town but it's got a library and it's got you know we passed a medical center and stuff coming in from the other side and um, yeah so it's quite looks quite interesting yeah so it's even got its own little cinema and it says this is the um, yeah, longest running picture theatre in South Canterbury, 1925. How cool is that? <laughs> in 1983 it says they held the premiere of the movie Farlap. Oh here. right. Mm. Geraldine Cheese Company. And a beautiful old stone church on the other side there. Accommodation in there. Beautiful old building, eh? Oh, yeah, stunning. What does that say? Oh yeah, they do. Yes. Oh, yeah, they do. So fear, obey, silence, submit, quiet, psychological warfare. <laughs> tractor down the main street. <laughs> Gotta love it. Little gin distillery tucked away down the back there. Bring Rewa down for a bit of a wander around the park. Yeah, so while um, Geraldine's not an overly big place, it's only half an hour away from, or probably about that, half an hour or so away from Timaru. When you look at what such a beautiful day it is today, it's hard to believe that it's going to be blowing this afternoon, but that's what they say. But this time, if it gets bad, I'll film it. Because <laughs> it's something I didn't do last time, but but actually we're, we're tucked in behind a shelter about this time, so um, we should be fine. Cheers! <laughs> Cheers!